Good morning, I'm Polarized Moon and welcome back to Minecraft. So, we've done, uh, uh, well I've done a few things off camera. First off, I moved, uh, as you can see here, I moved everything out of my little, little house here and I moved everything over to this cave. Uh, I also did quite a bit of just general upkeep and building, you know, stuff that isn't that much different from what it was before. So I've got a little cow farm here, I've got a little, I got a little wheat farm. General, general weedy stuff. And I built up my little cave, look at that. We've got, um, I've got some armor stands over there for when I get armor, I've got a bow. I've just got all my general stuff in here. And I've got a little bedroom over here. So this is my new little bedroom. And I've got, a, you know, a nice little fireplace going on. Uh, I haven't decorated these walls yet, but I'll get there eventually. Um, and then here's my little axolotl pond when I get those. Oh, uh, another thing, I need to... I need to turn on subtitles because I have heard that it's much easier to find axolotls when there's subtitles. Got a storage room. We've just got general... For when I get overflow of a whole bunch of a specific item, I'll bring it in here. Got my stone cutter. Uh, here's the first... I, I redid my... I redid my cave here. Uh, I did the thing where I like to do where it's where it's slabs and full blocks so that it, it you know makes a nice descending pattern um, this I haven't decided what that's gonna be yet so we'll figure that out as we go and then we can go down here and here's that first the Saisho cave which would be the first cave that I found um, so yeah I can come down here and I've, I've kind of cleared out this whole this whole area uh, well I there, I didn't really find anything new here, so what's <laughs> so basically I just have to um, there's there's nothing really new here. I mean, other than this stuff, I probably need to get like a, a what you call it for that a um a silk touch. I probably need to get silk touch if I want to get that, unless I can grow it somehow, and I'm not entirely sure how I'm gonna do that. But I've basically been using this for gathering various types of stone and resources that I need. Whenever I come down here, and there's pretty much nothing here that's you know useful to find. Uh, other than I did find a where did I put it? Ah, here we go. I did find a lava, a lava, a little tiny lava pond here. So I have some lava that I can use for for fuel and and such. Uh, I so I learned a few things about how axolotls spawn. Um, I haven't finished this part yet, but um. They spawn in, they spawn in the underwater, they have to spawn in zero light condition, or zero light. So, um, I accidentally, while I was going through here, I accidentally came across this little, um, this little pond here. Maybe, maybe we can get an axolotl to, to spawn in here. Um, I'm probably gonna fix this so that I can keep going, but also get into here without, uh, without light getting in. So, yeah, there's that. Oh, you know what I should do with that big empty room? I know what I'm gonna do with the big empty room. I'm gonna turn that into my portal room. Um, because I need a portal room. And I have lava, and... Uh, I have lava, and I've got water. I can make... Uh, I can make a portal. Let's, let's do that. Let me grab this. And, yeah, let's, let's turn this into a portal room. Um... So, let's see. I do kind of want it to just be the whole wall. So, we're going to do that uh around the whole <laughs> around the whole area. Oh, and my stone pickaxe broke. I always have backups. Um again, I like to keep stone pickaxes and like general like uh, common common tools. I like them to keep them as uh stone just so that I I use up a lot of the stone that I have and I can keep the uh, I can keep the iron ones and diamond ones for for better things later. Uh, maybe I should make another bucket. I don't know. We'll uh, we'll we'll make this quick and then head head down there or head down into the Nether. So this might take a while. Um, actually, what I what I wanted what I should do is I should just kind of like generally kind of wander around down here in case I find a if I can hear some axolotls because that way then I can um because I can just check my my little thing over there 
Because it's entirely possible that I'll run across axolotls sounds when I'm down here. Uh, I do have an extra bucket. I have a water bucket I can use to get the get the axolotl if I if I come across them. Um, have I gone up here? This is where I came from. Yeah. I might as well check for any uh, any other general ores and stuff that I want to. Oh, whoops! That's not what I wanted to do. Ow. Now let's just check for any just general blocks and stuff that I want to pick out. And also, doing this will likely, potentially, cause me to get closer to a hole somewhere where I can hear an axolotl. I don't know where... I don't know where any are, but we'll, we'll find them. It is actually nice to see... to be able to see all the sounds in the bottom left there. Or bottom right. I know directions, shush. Oh, hello. What's this? Oh, this is just another... <laughs> I was like, wait a second, that's different. And basically, I'm going to be u mostly using this coal for, um, mostly just for making, uh, torches so that I can make more, uh, lanterns. I really like how the lanterns look for, for decoration and stuff. They look a lot nicer than, uh, right, hold on, I need, I need to be able to get back out. Uh, I do want to find some more iron. I don't know if I've, don't know if I've, uh, got iron in here anywhere. Item plops. That's really funny. Uh, there we go. And let's get this stuff here. Because this isn't my, my home area, I don't mind that this, you know, is a little bit, uh, destroyed looking. I think this is the lowest section in this cave here. Um, if I'm gonna be doing any extra mining, I'd probably want to do, um, probably want to do it from here. Oh, I missed this one. I think, I think this is the lowest section I've got. So if I wanted to go deeper, I'd probably do it from here, right? Maybe, maybe not. Alright. Maybe I'll just kind of run through here and dig a little bit deeper every time we, uh, every time we come by. And then, we can, uh... Figure out how to... There we go. I, I can just do a, a spiral staircase down here. Oh! Hello! We've got another... We've got another potential axolotl spawn here. Oh, perfect! How did I manage to... Okay. Alright. How did I manage that one? Uh, okay, let's, um... Oh, I hear a zombie. Let's block that up. Wow, that's hilarious. I guess we should, uh, check, you know, generally check this area every so often. Okay, cool. I wonder how many, um, I wonder how many little caves we're gonna find. How, uh, I wonder how often axolotls spawn. So, like, if I go back down over towards my, towards my little area, you know, that, the other spot that I've got that they can spawn, like, how often... How often do I have to go there to check? Or how often can I go th to check to see when I'll when I'll get it? Is it very often and then they they despawn quickly or I know that there's a variety of colors and I believe blue is the rarest color to find. Um I'm not entirely sure about how rare the other colors are. Oh, have I not been up here? Oh, hey, look, I found a new area. Um also I should be checking my Aha! Uh -huh. Here we go. There's nothing here. I should be keeping an eye on my, um, on my audio little thing there. I think I skipped over some copper down here also. Uh, gravel. Alright. Oh, here's, here's some copper. I, other than, other than lightning rods, I still don't know what copper is used for. Um, also, I do know that it does oxidize on its own. The way that I, you know, what I was talking about previously about how copper oxidizes in the air. Uh, I guess if you make copper blocks, they'll oxidize like that. So they'll turn green over time, which I think is pretty cool. And then I guess there's a way to stop it by putting, uh, wax on them. I discovered that by seeing a, uh... On my recommended page on YouTube, there was a, a video of 
someone built the Statue of Liberty out of copper, and then there was a time lapse of it oxidizing. And I thought, oh, that's really cool. Splashing. Ooh, ooh, splashing. Glow squid. Whoa. Whoa, that is so cool. Uh, I know I can make like, oh my God. I know I can make like glow frames with the glow ink, the glow squid ink. Oh, that sounded creepy. Glow ink sack. All right. Yeah, let, let's put that there. Um, I, that was, okay, admittedly that was really cool, but it also was not what I was looking for. Uh, but now I can make glow frames and I'll, I'll have to figure out how those work. Uh, because that'll be really cool to have. Let's go check, um, oh, let's go put my, my, my piece of lava in my, in my portal, portal room frame up here. Uh, I should probably just put some lights in here. Just so that nothing spawns. There we go. Yeah, every time I come down here, I'm just gonna go grab a bucket so that I can put it in my my frame there. And this is a way you can get um, this is a way you can get a portal without needing uh, or without having diamond, because I haven't found diamond yet. Because I haven't really been looking, but I I was kind of just having a mind. Oh wait, no, I was gonna go down. Oh well, I might as well. There we go. All right, this time I'm gonna go down. I, I just instinctively went back. Take some of that, more of that. Let's go check the, the hole down here. Uh, because I really want to get an axolotl. <laughs> They're so adorable, and I want to see how they work. So, I guess you can't, um, you can name them, but you can't tame them. But they won't despawn if you've picked them up in a bucket and placed them back down. Oh, more glow squid. All right, so I guess those spawn a lot faster and easier than uh, than axolotls do. Oh, you're you look like you're gonna die. Okay, can do glow squids? I wonder if glow squids prevent axolotls from spawning because they they light up the area. That I I don't know if that's how that works. I need to raise the ceiling on this too. Um, I guess I'm gonna have to do that in my- again in my spare time. But yeah, the, the- the kind of stuff where I'm just like mining out a tunnel and things like that, I'm not gonna show on camera. Just because that- it's really boring to watch. Or at least for- for a lot of people. I know some people enjoy- Some people enjoy stuff like that, but, um, there we go, we got the bottom done. Oh, rain! Hello! Nice! Cool. Uh, yeah, so I want to get I want to get an axolotl before the end of this episode um, Hopefully one will spawn in one of the two One of the two locations that we've got so I guess I just kind of have to hang out near them and maybe we'll We'll hear we'll hear one that also doesn't mean that we won't like randomly stumble across another uh, Like another hole that has one so should I go kill that glow squid then um because it might be preventing my the axolotl from spawning. So let's let's do that. Okay, cool. I need to go grab some more. Um, I need to go make another pickaxe. I hear a skeleton somewhere. So that means I think that means that there's another cave somewhere that I haven't found yet. That's nearby. So maybe I want to be searching for that as well. Okay, that's the that's the other way that I came out. I'm gonna have to learn learn the layout of this cave a little bit better. Grab a lava. Let's do bop, bop. There we go. That sounded up. Yeah, that sounded really close. There's got to be another. Oh, hi. Can you spawn in lava? I thought that. Okay, I didn't realize that they could spawn like that. All right, interesting. All right, let's go check the... Oh, crap. Oh, dang it. I mean, I could just put another one here. I item plops, I think, is one of the funniest. It's it, it sounds hilarious, and it also is exactly what that sound is. Just item plops.
I've also been fixing my staircase, basically, so, like, anything that's not just regular stone, I've been replacing with regular stone. I know it does sound, it sound, it sounds like a uh, waste of resources, but I actually like, I like everything to be, like, uniform when I'm building an area. Like, the, the staircase is just gonna end up all being, um, the staircase is gonna end up all being, like, regular stone. Or maybe and is it later? I don't know. We'll we'll figure it out. Uh, I should put a torch. Oh, I how did I miss that? Yeah, so like I'm gonna take those out and replace the replace the walls with stone. Uh or regular stone. I could probably even do smooth stone, but smooth stone has like a like a thing around it. Maybe I'll replace the walls with like and is it or like smooth and is it like I did up at the up at the main room. Axolotls? Oh. Did something die in here? Oh, I I didn't even Oh wait, hold on. I need uh iron for this. Look at that. Oh, there's another one over here too. Cool. I didn't even think about that. Okay, cool. I'll I'll take those. There we go. Um, I, I feel like for the very last one, I'm probably gonna have to break off a piece of the wall. Let's go back down again. I want to find, I want to find axolotls. We're, we're, we're gonna, we're gonna get it. Are we, we good? We good? I have a feeling that I would, oh, splashing. Oh, the splashing was from the, the stone that I literally just broke. All right. Anything useful? Let me go grab, uh, more lava. There we go. Oh! Lightning! Is that what that sounded like before? That sounds a lot more, like... That sounds a lot more realistic than it did, I think, right? Or am I just... Or am I just being dumb about it? Ooh! Hello! You've got armor and enchanted stuff that I... That I might want. No, you get back here. Did I get anything from that? Uh, I got gold. Oh, excuse you. Oh, I am almost dead. <laughs> I didn't even realize. I probably should have go went to grab my armor before I fought that. But, uh, you know me. Rush headlong into battle without a second thought. Alright, I probably should just sleep. Oh, <laughs> I'm sleeping with the stone. Is it done raining now? And... Kill you! There we go. Uh, I got some golden leggings with projectile protection. There you go. Have some gold. Uh, oh, let's go get more lava. And then we're gonna check my locations again. Well, let's check the one down here first. Um, and then we'll come back up and check the other one. Oh, there's a skeleton. Oh, hi. Well, there's not much I can do about you spawning, so... Oh well. Let's go grab some more lava. Perfect. Yes? Oh, looks like another... Another one died at some point. It looks like, just like regular squids, they like to, uh, they like to die. <laughs> it looks like a lot like regular squids, they just like to, to just beach themselves and then immediately die. Axolotls don't die so quickly outside of, um, outside of water, so that's, that's good, at least. I wonder what the axolotls sound like. Because there's there's a lot of so just general sounds in this game that would take me, a, you know, a long time to just hear. All right. You know what? Let's just uh, let's just finish off this portal real quick. I might as well just get it done so we can go to the Nether. Up. That's also using up this lava too. I mean, we can always get more lava from the Nether as well. But I like to prioritize getting lava from from the Overworld first because. There's just, you know, it's it's a lot easier to, 
you know, to clear out a small thing and just have have lava all ready to go. All right, here we go. There we go. You can also make lava cauldrons. Oh, I haven't figured out how dripstone works just yet either. That's another thing I'm probably gonna probably gonna look up. See, this time I'm not I'm not gonna just avoid looking looking things up this time. You know, if there's something that I want to learn, I'm gonna you know I'm gonna look it up so I don't be stupid about it and take many many episodes to to do it. Grab that one. I like to grab the top layer first. I'm super neurotic about so many <laughs> so many random things. There we go. And let me put that put that piece back. Bop. You know, one thing I always like to do, I think is really cool, when when you make like a a portal room, a cool thing that I like to do is make an exact replica of that room on the other side and make it be like but like mirrored. Um Oh, crap. <laughs> That was dumb. I have to make an extra trip now, and I lost one of my lavas. Hopefully we, we get a good um, portal, or we get a good biome in the nether. There we go. Two more. And then I'm also gonna wanna make a fishing room because I like fishing, and you can get some generally good equipment doing that in this game. That's usually how I do most of my enchanting, to be honest. I very rarely use an enchanting table. I oftentimes just do fishing and get enchanted books and then anvil them together. Um, that one? Look at that, we're getting, we're getting down to some of the stone. Nice. There we go, portal is ready. Um, let me grab my flint and steel and light it on fire. And then we can see where we're see where we're at. Portal room. Bop. Nice. Done. Fantastic. Let's go check out this portal. Where are we going? Oh. Alright. We're in a fairly decent location. Um I don't see anything particularly interesting other than you know we're in a we're in a nice biome let's see anything uh oh oh my god seriously <laughs> oh my god hold on wow i seriously found a i am oh oh my god there's a lot of things shooting at me um here let's do All right. All right. Let's uh kill you. Come on. Is there another one? Uh actually I can just kind of Oh, what? Excuse you. That's not very nice. Oh, why do I only have one of the nether bricks? Didn't I break two of them? Ow. Ow. Ow, excuse you. I wanted to get in there. Ah, uh, there's too many, too many of them. Nope, don't shoot at me, please. I wanna get rid of, oh, there's the other brick. It's right there, I wanna go get that. It is nice that you're moving towards, towards me. Okay, cool, now I can get this guy. Oh, crap. What do we got? Obsidian, some horse armor, some iron horse armor, and I'm just gonna take the, the this. And then let's uh, patch this back up for now. And then we'll find a different way in later. <laughs> but that's really cool. I, I already, I literally already found a, found a <laughs> fortress. This is a really great spawn location. All right, so that'll be that for now. Uh, that's about all the time we've got for this episode. Like and subscribe if you liked the episode. Ring that bell if you'd like to see more. Good night, and we're going to, uh, I'm not sure what we're gonna do, but we'll, 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 uh, we'll, oh, we're gonna go try to find an axolotl tomorrow. Bye-bye!